safely with elegance for less i am excited to be able to do this diy because it's so all about the heart for this project is a piece of cardboard i went ahead and cut out this cardboard actually i used the dollar tree heart to trace it on a piece of cardboard it's a lace out. fabric that has roses on it and i haul that from hobby lobby and you will need a canvas now hobby lobby have four i want to say it was five five in a pack of canvas for 9.99 i thought that was a really good buy so i went ahead and purchased the set of canvas i want to use one of them in this project so you're going to need a heart cardboard you're going to need a lace rose and i chose rose because of course roses you always think of romance love and that's for valentine's and your canvas spray paint and i'm not sure if i'm going to add diamond wrap but we will see so i'm going to go out and spray paint my canvas first i believe i will spray paint it red and then i'll go back over it with pink so that's what I have in mind. Let's go on out and see what we Okay guys, so as I was spray painted, I could hear someone asking me the question, how did I do that? So I spray painted first with red, a dark red, and then I went and lay the fabric over the red then spray painted it with a darker pink and a lighter pink. Now I'm waiting for it to dry somewhat, not all the way. Then I'll place the heart on top. So guys, this is how it turned out. Totally love that. Um, this is the side. Now I am going to leave some space in between so that you can see the red and I'm going on directly on top. So I'm going on top of the canvas and laying one strip, not two. I thought of two, but I decided I wanted to go with one strip. So I'm going to leave a space. Now you have to be very careful because this is going to be on the top, which is very visible. So the line has to be straight. So be very careful, go slowly. Okay guys, so I went ahead and add some of the gems to outline the heart. And I must tell you, that is beautiful. So, now I have decided that this little Dollar Tree sign that we have, it says love on it, and I want to take that away. And it's made from paper, but it has this iridescent, um, like this glow on it that I think would be perfect to go well with the gems that is on this project.
Okay guys, hopefully you liked that project that we just did. Now we're going to do a project with these signs that I've shared with you guys before. It is the live, the laugh, and the memory. So you will need all three. You could choose whatever words you want, whatever you desire for your family, for your home. And don't forget, these are all last minute gifts ideas that you can share with your family or you can give to a friend. You will also need one of these Dollar Tree uh, heart. They are the stone, a little heavy. And this is what it looks like. It's a little stone. I think it looks better, more of a heart on this side than it does on the other side. So we'll decide which way we want to go. So you will need that. You will need glitter. I want to go with red and a pink mixture that I already had with silver and gold and white. I'm going to go with that. You will also need spray paint and you will, I think I'm going to do red and pink, of course, because I've got the red and pink glitter here. And you will need a popsicle two stick. popsicle sticks and went ahead and hot glue them onto the back of my heart. Now they are going to work as an anchor for both the sign and the heart. So guys, I glued the heart to the popsicle sticks and then glued it onto both sides. Then I add a popsicle stick underneath just so that we have some security with both signs being able to be stabilized with the popsicle sticks. So now I want to take my word memory and I'm going to hot glue it onto the top of this two sign, two words, just like that. All right, so I'm gonna hot glue it, come back and show you what that looks like. Okay guys, so I am finished. I went ahead and add some of the Walmart gems all throughout the word and it's memory live love laugh I'm going to put it somewhere where you can take a look at it clean up these cobwebs and you let me know what your thoughts are okay guys I hope that you love the way that this turned out if you do give me a thumbs up share with your family and friends I truly appreciate your time your support and I look forward to seeing you on my next DIY.